Kansas inside a nearly sold out Bramlage Coliseum on a beautiful Friday. The number one seed, the winner of our game will. And we're ready to go as Kansas State in their white jerseys go right inside. To and Briley Glenn, the twin sisters, along with Serena Sundell, they've been starting three years in a row together. Emmy Shearer. Gosh, just Aoka repairs. Inside early, Kansas State up seven to nothing over the number 13 seed, Portland. They go in him about this Portland press and if he was concerned about it. The one thing he said that he liked, Portland out of the West Coast Conference go inside the Cochran, so beating them 90 to 40 Ooh. in the regular season. And they came back and beat them in the W. All Big 12 first team point guard. Yeah, so much on freshman and to see her I didn't see her last year to see her now how her growth her body gives Sundell another free throw attempt and you don't want to do that Virginia in the quarterfinals of the Big 12 championship and lost to Texas the eventual champions in the semifinal six of them to to be exact on this Portland team high post drive to the bucket Sundell Cochran. Aoka Lee came out on her. The shot clock is winding down. And that will be Pilots. Over the top to Sundell. Sundell nice. pushing it in. Sundell misses going here as the shot clock is winding down once again. Three on the clock. Two. Abby Gregory puts the ball on the floor, ducks nice. underneath for K-State. Burnham missing that one. Nice offensive nice. rebound and put back by Shearer. That look, I think she can hit that shot. Keeps Lee in the paint. And there's Lee going to work. Four-time All-Big 12 first team. The only other hanging in the rafters here at Bramlage Coliseum as Phenomenal. It just, she made it look easy. <laughs> and how about that from Mikkel Meek at the free throw line, of course, her, and was the Oregon 6A State Player of the Year out of Beaver. This is a team in Portland that forces almost 20 turnovers per, per game. Nice backdoor nice. pass. Kansas at the free throw line. Well, for the five seconds on the clock. It's swatted away by Glenn. Retrieving it. Participation thing when they get three stops in a row. Everybody's cheering. Everybody's holding their goats as Portland to get them a Gabby goat. And Gabby Gregory, not Gabby. Because she really likes goats. Well, good for her. <laughs> well, everybody, K-State fans, I, I just love it because you, you don't generally think of K-State as a defensive team. Kansas State, they, you may not think of them as a defensive team, but some of their numbers are the best in the big team. And that's their game, that's their game plan. Go inside to Jalen Glenn, to Sundell, looking for Moppin. Got it. Gabby Gregory, nice crossover. Sanchez from the free throw line. Portland has not been able to hit a three-pointer. They're 0 for 5. Let's see if I... Yeah, you got to go inside the lead right here. Over the top in between two defenders. But this year, four-time All-Big 12 first-teamer. She's quick, got great hands. If you're a guard, you want to play with her. You can throw the ball in you. And Portland with some work to do. In and out for good look. And a good steal from Burnham, anticipating. Cuts between a couple of defenders. Respect and admiration for Lisa Mattingly. Great official and has done a great job in Portland. And a great, well, they could have had Kyle yeah, there. Yeah, they're, they're just a little hesitant. You, why? Because there's great ball pressure. They can't see the... Sundell looking over to Walker. Rat Gabby cut. Gregory with a nice cut in the score. <laughs> Diani Ananiev. The freshman out of Australia for Portland. Briley Glenn. So Briley Glenn being tended to. 
Mocha Lee missing now. Meek using the screen from Cochran. Cochran steps back. The three-pointer short from... We just watched them grow up. Ren, I love with Portland. They, they threw the free throw line. Averages almost 12 points a game. Makes both free throws. She gets... They're just going to get after it. So Kansas State has led the entire game. They've led by as many as 20 points. She averages double figures per game along with Shearer and Burnham. Sanchez straight away. You can see what a quality team this is. It is, and it turn that assist in a season for K-State this year. Aoka Lee, the only player. Just eight points by this Portland Pilots defense. Good work inside, scored for Kansas State. Nice. Good cut. Hamilton decides yeah. to fire it up and hits a three. That's the first three-pointer. Gabby Gregory, as time is winding down, short. And a little route ended on a 14-6 run, and that has allowed them to close the gap to 12 defensively. And you can see how big of a priority that is for Kansas State as she gets the first touch. Cochran. Sundell inside to Lee, got another one. A couple of players in foul trouble with em Emmy Shearer with a this Portland team is not going to back down because this free throw leads them into. Sundell puts it on the floor, a little floater. Aoka Leach. Portland does a great job of scoring from the out of bounds plays. A lot of movement. And there they didn't put it right there. And it was 14 to four. Kansas State had built up a lead to 20 at this Kansas State lead. It's all about turnovers for Portland. And, and wow. They're, just, they're pulling Lee away from the basket. Burnham snake hands, quick feet. Burnham now in double figures for Portland with 11. And she just picked up her fourth foul on the drive to the basket from Briley Glade. And Sundell steps in and steals it. Yeah, that, that's a lot better. <laughs> Sundell blocked the top of the ball. Aoka Lee triple teamed. Out to Gregory, got it. Fouls in the quarter. And Portland, 14 fouls. As Hamilton, this resulted in, in getting two shots at the free throw line. Hamilton playing our best basketball right now. And great time to play your best basketball. Cochran, she had a, did a great job of drawing that foul. You know, and Cochran never had to defend someone like Aoka <laughs> Lee. No. As Lee makes both free throws. And to the free throw line. Gabby Gregory, a little up and under. No. Lee gets the rebound. Aoka Lee now with 17 points. She had eight at halftime. Yeah. Justin, you take what the defense gives you. Right now, he's posting up his guards. Riley Glenn. They challenge themselves by playing teams from the Pac-12 like Oregon and Stanford. And Lee up over Cock Porter. But she gets that. Come, you're home for all 90 NCAA champions. To 14 with two minutes remaining in the third. Cochran gets the tip ball, can't convert. Walker goes into Lee, who is camped out in the lane. Fogle at the free throw line for the pilot. She makes the second. It was the third foul. Back the last six games, but sometimes those extra rests are important for Lee. Meek from three. Second. Burnham in traffic, throws it up. No. Kansas State up 57 to 45 as we start the fourth quarter here in Manhattan. After the first quarter, they led by as many as 20, but Portland has made it tough on them. Aoka Lee isn't on the court right now. She scored 11 of the 17 points for Kansas State. In the third. Shearer back on the court with the four fouls for Portland. Burnham with the nine. Walker behind the back. Rises up. 
step for yeah. move, Burnham. Nice step, having to adjust on what they want. Burt and Dickey have scored since the first quarter. As they go inside, the Burnham is having some. Hamilton at the free, or Hamilton committed the foul, sending Gabby Gregory. Gregory often Ayoka Lee's screen. Headed to the batting about four and a half points a game, but she's had a terrific game today. Yeah, she they just swarm the ball. They just make you play nervous. Which everybody gets involved. So it's going to be a really fun game. Dickey got that one. What they did a lot. Again, player movement, ball movement, get an easy look. Go up high. Or go inside. Or go the clock. Gregory faces up, and it's just how Portland has stayed in this game. Inbounds play, and, and one. Ten on the shot clock. Good job of being patient. Gregory. Hamilton trying to push. Burnham ducks underneath and scores. The Wildcats, keep your dribble. Don't pick up the ball. Kick out. Gregory gets Burnham, who already has a season high, did to about under 10, and then they'll decide what they're going to do. Lee has been kicking out a lot this quarter. This time, Otto and Drake coming up next. Two seconds on the shot clock. Walker! Just content to hold on to the ball as long as they can. And but she had a great start to this game for Kansas State. That one goes over. They scrapped and made it a close game, but Kansas State Court advancing the number four seed to the second round, and they will play. Takes a lot of respect. Portland came in here and gave it their all, representing the West Coast Conference extremely well. They will play on Sunday. Times to be determined. The winner of the Colorado.